Nice garden. Just look with your eyes. No touching. We still have a lot to do. We need to get back to work. We still have to renovate an antique cabinet for our neighbor. Ah, oh, that'll be fun. Oh, I love furniture. But make sure you don't sand too deep this time. Maybe you can use it to call someone. It looks kind of... I was just trying to catch the thief. It was a nice little... Well, pumpkin. It looks kind of... It There's a little stone face in the crystal. Hmm. I hear very, very like someone. Probably handling the amber. I'd better leave that where I want to be around here. No, I'd bet securely. That would do. That would do. Road ships are cool, but disappointingly useless. Don't keep me waiting too long. I'm getting hungry for something sweet.
I don't want to make the spider mad. And if the web breaks, it's no... I'd better be... There's a weird symbol in the poem underneath. How he made a... After drawing all... Then a... Black... Then three... At the... Set... Welcome to Masswood, newcomer. Your friend with the red eyes seem familiar to me. Here's some well-meaning advice from me to you. Stay within the town, all right? The crows are circling low over the woods today. Hey, who are you? I've never seen you here before. Nonsense. He came for here earlier today. Yeah? Yeah, together with a rabbit with weird red eyes. Well, I remember that one. I'm Jerry Hazelnut, magician in training. Magician? You? I might have bought that from your friend with the red eyes, but... Oh, why do I have to stand guard out here while you get to have fun? <laughs> oh. Have you seen Plato the Frog by any chance? I've been waiting here for a package from the Super Squirrel Boutique for Smart Squirrels. Oh, maybe I should have left town with my cousin Edward instead of standing here and thinking about how the clones could come back at any time. It just feels that I've just got to have my package. I'll get good luck. Natural history. How about so brainy stuff here, nature stuff there? Th that is exactly what I am doing. Here are those with a red cover, and over there is where those with green covers will go. Uh, are you sure that's a good idea? But, but of course. Then you can find the red books immediately when you look for them. I mean, no one ever reads the green ones anyway. Weird stuff, that is. In Literaria, they didn't have green books at all. Oh, Jonathan, you've never even been there. Of course I have. <laughs> but uh, naturally, it was during a <clears throat> reading tour. <laughs> As you can see, young man, Jonathan's sorting skills are just as dreadful as his sense of humor. <laughs> A little laugh now and then can't hurt. I always tell people the crows cause the mess, and Ursula makes sure that it stays that way. <laughs> May I bother you for a second? No, I'm working. On what are you working on? Brain work. <laughs> that means he's staring into space. <laughs> I am thinking and planning. What is there to plan? We must replenish our stores. A crow must have feasted in here during the evacuation. For months, our beautiful mousewood has been subjected to aggressive crow attacks. Those crows are feral, almost incapable of speaking. Ooh, a very unsettling situation. I wonder if there's a mouse inside. Nope. Empty. Interesting furnishings. Stylish and edible. Those are the public funds of our community. Many of the town's workers prefer nuts as payment. Ooh A table shaped like a three-leafed clover. The clover leaf has a special meaning for us. Oh, it symbolizes the cooperation of the three permanent members of the Mousewood Town Council. 
three. Our third member is Hannah Mouse. We have not seen her since the evacuation during the last crow attack. A knight's armor, just like in a book. Well, if knights had been little hamsters, well, that would have been so cute. Nobody would have wanted to fight a war. And that would be Did I... Knights... What did they... Another one! And another... <laughs> My head sounds almost the same. The pumpkins here are incredibly... On the other hand, I have been talking by comparison. The tree is like a second sky over Masswood, only greener and more tree-like. It looks like wood. It's eyes, yes, very. Nothing needs to be. That doesn't need to be. Nightcap, sleeping drops. It says a bottle costs one leaf buck. Hmm, I don't have any, not even one. Hello. Good day, my friends. I've always wanted. That's the right ad. If you want to host with. Sharp? Yes. Uh, yes. I. What should I. Oh, something fun. Oh. <laughs> Where? Why did the. Ch Ooh, that'll go. The leaf. Oh. Uh, Try to come up. Try again. I have to be. See you soon. And remember, swamp raid mole in the mole, mole at noon and mole. The door is now open. Hey, hey you. This is private property. Yes. Uh oh. Empty. One hot coffee. Hmm, that won't work. Nothing needs to be tapped from there. Mouse walks around totally lost in thought. It doesn't even notice I'm here. I know you're out there somewhere. Come back soon. I'll take care of your garden until then. Hmm. <laughs> Thanks, 
extravagant. There's a sign. Roof terrace closed. Danger of abduction by crows. That doesn't sound good. Remember, there are no problems, only challenges. Hello, young man. That's what old Uli would have said now. Who's old Uli? Ah, uh, a dear friend of mine. See the picture on the counter. This little herbal pharmacy belongs to him. I see. So, is he out getting more herbs? Well, he's on an adventure and will be gone a very long time. Hmm. Ah, I almost forgot something, Apple Cheeks. <laughs> One of Uli's painted sugar-free lollipops for you. Sugar-free? I also baked Uli's herbs into some buns. But it turned out that nobody wanted them like that. I can't imagine why. Oh, I knew you'd appreciate Uli's herbs. Hey, they're a bit dry, but... Dry? Oh, just have fun licking the lollipop and nibbling the cake, my little cinnamon bun. <laughs> 